Good morning. I'm Jeannie Snedeker, and I'm the Director of Christian Education. I'd like to invite our children forward. Soren. Hi, Emerson. You coming up? That's wonderful. We got everybody? Hi, everybody. How are you? Good. I sure am happy you're all here today. Today we're celebrating one of the special ministries in our church. We have lots of special ministries, but this is one of the ones that we see every week in worship. Tell me, do you guys like to celebrate? No? <laughs> No celebrating? Do you like to celebrate your birthday? No? Okay. <clears throat> Anybody else like to celebrate? Yes? I like to celebrate my birthday, Emerson. You know why? Because it's the day after Christmas, and you'd think that that would be a, a rough day to have a birthday, but I get to go shopping every year. My husband takes me shopping every year, and it's so much fun. Well, tell me some of the ways you celebrate when you're extra happy. Anybody set, do, do something special when you, what makes you be just bubble over with joy? I know a few of you are bubbled over with joy when you do certain things. No ideas? How about when you, do you bubble over with joy when you play a sport maybe? When you play softball. Yes, I was counting on you saying that. <laughs> Anybody else have something special? Oh, hi, Hugh. Come on up, buddy. That's okay that you're late. No worries. No worries. We're just getting started, buddy. So tell me, what, do you do something special when, you, when you're extra happy? What do you do? Uh, sometimes I draw. Sometimes you draw, so art makes us happy. What do you do? Yesterday I saw you at the, at the, the fire party. You guys were at a Halloween party together? Oh, so you've already been celebrating. That's wonderful. Well, let me tell you, today the ministry that we're celebrating is music. And I happen to love music. I loved music when I was your size. And actually, when we were singing the first hymn just now, it reminded me of being in church when I was a little tiny girl. I have a sister, and my mom is an organist, or was an organist. She's retired now. And she would play these great big loud hymns, and we'd dance all over the sanctuary because nobody else was in there. And it was just such a wonderful way to express joy. Well, it is still, as a grown-up, it is still one of the deepest, happiest ways I feel God in my life is to sing and play music and to listen to music. Music's a big part of my life. But that's not the only way you can celebrate, right? There's lots of wonderful ways. In Psalm 98, it says, make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. So celebrating is not just for us. It's for the entire earth. The seas roar and the hills sing for joy. So there's lots of ways that we celebrate God. And I think one thing to remember is we sometimes forget that part. When we pray to God, when we talk to God, we remember to ask for help. We remember to say, God, I'm very scared or I'm, I'm sad today. We remember to say thank you. But sometimes we forget just to be, just to be with God and to be joyful with God. And that can mean you're running on the beach or you're playing softball. That could mean you're singing. But it can also mean you're just being with God and just feeling that overwhelming joy inside. Wait, right? Even, but even if Billie Eilish is singing? Even if Billie Eilish is singing, that can sometimes bring you joy as well, right? <laughs> yes, absolutely. So however, boys and girls, however we experience joy... I want you to remember that God is right there with you experiencing joy as well. And, and, and it's just, it's such a wonderful thing to remember that God is with us when we're sad and when we're scared, but also when we're just filled to overflowing with joy. Okay? So we're going to say a prayer, but I need you to listen real quick because we're going to do something different. We're going to sit right in that second seat where, where um, Soren and, and Emerson's dad is sitting. We're going to sit right there, and we're going to get to watch part of the celebration, okay? And then we're going to go to Sunday school and do some of our own celebrating. How's that? Okay, so let's all say a prayer together. Wonderful creator, we celebrate this day, your abiding presence in our world and in each of our lives. We thank you for your love, and we thank you for these children and the joy they bring to our church family. Fill us with joy to overflowing, and may we be so filled up that we can't help
but make a joyful noise. Amen. All right, guys, come here.